now, Janice Hogate, she called the helpline for her daughter, and you can call the helpline for someone that you love, and our road producers went out. Take a look at this. When Dina was a little girl, she was very outgoing, was in on all our plays at church, and then in her teenage years, she started getting a little shy, and that progressed into her having a, a serious problem with anxiety to the point of her not being able to speak or go out, do things that she normally would do. And she wanted to commit herself into a hospital. She um, had been given medication by the doctor and uh, she took it for a while and then decided she didn't want to feel like that. And then she enrolled in the school and finding out that every class until you graduate, there's a presentation. If she couldn't go to that presentation, it was just going to ruin her. So I knew that it was desperate that she had to just walk through that door. And I knew she couldn't do it by herself. And so I was flipping through the channels on Saturday night, and um, I saw a helpline. And she had so much anxiety, I decided to call. And the lady on the other end prayed for her, and we agreed. You can always ask God for help and to pray and see Him work in your life. And so Monday she went down there and she did her presentation and the teacher told her, she said, you did the best in the whole school. And she about fainted. <laughs> but from then on, it's been a struggle, but never a thought of not doing it. So that's the miracle to me that she is able to keep going. If I could meet Dr. Cirillo, I would thank him for uh, taking his time and energy to do a show like Helpline that does help people that they can call in and get agreement for prayer. You know, Greg, there's no accidents in God. So many people tell us, I was just flipping the channels and Helpline appeared. Yes. And that was the answer to my problems. <laughs>